Hi, kids. Um, today I've got something really special. Look at this. I'm gonna go fishing, just like Hope did. Remember? She didn't. She forgot to take me. But anyway, I'm gonna go fishing. You guys, we have an awesome lesson for you today. So let's get started. Uh, I gotta find this spot. So there were these money guys that caught up to Peter, AKA Jesus's best friend one day. And they said, hey, Peter. And he said, hey, what? They said, do you follow Jesus? Are you one of Jesus's followers? And he was like, yeah, I am. Because Jesus is the best ever. And I am his friend. And they said, okay, well, that's great. But how come he didn't pay the money he was supposed to pay to the temple. And Peter what froze. Money? Well, so there was this money that if you lived in Jerusalem, that you, you had to pay because you paid money to live there, to sleep there, to eat there, to walk there, and everyone did it. You just had to do it Gross. if you lived there. Right, I know, it's kind of not. So he, they were wondering why Jesus didn't pay that money. And Peter, he's like, uh oh, I actually don't know the answer to that question. But he didn't, he didn't want to tell them that. So he was like, well, you know, I'm sure he's, he paid it. I'm sure he's gonna. I mean, if he hasn't, he will, right? I have an idea how they can pay it. How? Have you ever, like that quarter thing, I don't, See if you can get a quarter from behind my ear. Okay, all I see is a bunch of earwax. It always works when my grandpa does it. There's no... All right. I wish, if I had money coming out of my ears, I'd be rich, Kate. <sighs> That's not how it works. Anyway, so Peter was thinking, uh, why didn't Jesus pay this tax? So he didn't know what to say and he was like, I'm sure he'll pay it and he ran away. He went and he found Bye. Jesus. Bye. <laughs> Hi, Jesus. I'm here to see you. Hello. He says, Jesus, how, how come you didn't pay the money that you were supposed to pay for living in Jerusalem? And Jesus said, Peter, do you pay your dad to live in your house? Do you pay him to give you the food out of the fridge? Peter was kind of like, no, that's silly. When I'm at home, I just get to live at my house. I don't pay my dad to give me that stuff. That's you, silly. Do you know what's really silly? I think I had a lizard in my kitchen. Oh, I, I think he was eating my cereal. All right. Are we ever talking about the animals Sorry. anymore? Okay, okay, back to the story. Goodness gracious. Back to the story. So Peter was thinking, that'd be super silly if I had to pay to live in my house. I wouldn't be paying my dad to get something out of my fridge. No, that's not how I live my life. And that's what Jesus said. Like, Peter, you don't have to pay to live in my house because you're my son. That means you get to be there because I love you like my son. Yeah. Do you, do you guys don't pay your parents to live at your house, do you? Do you? No. I don't either. But Jesus did tell Peter, I want to use you as a good example to tell others about me, to spread the love I have to give and the good I want for all of my people. So I'm going to provide this money for both of us to pay our tax because that's how you set a good example, by doing what you said you would do. Yeah. Peter, you said you'd pay the tax. We gotta pay the tax. So you might wanna go fishing. What? Yeah. How, like they don't, they actually don't have time to be off fishing again. How is that gonna, that doesn't pay you for anything. That's kind of what Peter thought too. Why would I go fishing right now? There's no time to waste. We have to do what we said we would do. Focus. Jesus said, you guys gotta go fishing because when you catch your first fish, you're gonna find the money you need to pay in its mouth. Just some little coins, right? What? Now. 
I've gone fishing, and all I catch is the, like the slimy, mean ones. There was never any money. The mean ones never have money in them. Um... I'm not fishing in the right spot. You're not. But Peter was, because he caught that fish, he opened its mouth and popped out a bunch of coins. The perfect amount of money for two people to get their taxes paid. No way! Right to the temple. Count them. Two people. Jesus, Peter. Peter ran to pay his tax and said, God provided for me. God provided for us, his children. He used a tiny little fish to provide. I mean, I don't, I like to eat fish and they sort of provide for me in my tummy, but not for giving me money. It's wild. Jesus did some crazy stuff. That's incredible. So Jesus gave these guys one little fish that helped them carry out what they said they would do. They said they'd pay their tax, so the fish had the money in it. By doing exactly what they said they would do, they set a great example for other people to do the same thing. So remember, you, Kate, and me can all do the same thing. We can all be good examples when we follow through with what we say we're gonna do. And that's it. Let's go do it. Welcome to What the Pet. What is What the Pet? Let's invite our good friend, Justin the yeah. Ranger. Hi, Justin. Hello, how are you? Okay, are you ready? Always. Razor's always ready. Justin is gonna wear the fancy goggles. Go ahead and get comfortable there. You bet. Sorry. Right. You said these are fancy, I can't see nothing. That's the point. What? He can't no. see anything. What? He's gotta try and guess what is on the table. What is it? Is it a pet? Is it not? We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Are I'm you ready? I'm really good with animals, so. Uh, let's let's do a test. That, that, that's my one. Yeah. Oh shoot! Yeah, that gives me yeah. good good understanding. Of okay. Going on around. Let's let's start. This one this one's quite special. I think this I, I can tell that's a rabbit. Um, actually, it's not a rabbit. I'm a rabbit. What? Sorry, Ranger. What? Yeah. I'm very good at animals. Let's let's try again. Okay. We'll, we'll give you another try. Oh, it's running away. Oh, this one. This is a small version of big thing. This this is definitely a baby kind of. Um, that's close. At least it's a bird. He didn't bite it, so that's good. No, he, he doesn't he did try bite it. Bite. He doesn't bite it. Ah, uh, okay, let's try this. Alright, here we go. I'll get this one for sure. Okay. Oh, that's a snake! <laughs> oh, snake! Alright. Let's try. Okay, it's okay. These are really hard. Don't feel bad. Really, really hard. Don't feel bad, Randy. I'm usually pretty good with animals, but maybe it's because I can't stand Sure. Okay. I got right. that one right. You did. Woo! You're yeah. like one for 27. <laughs> Keep up the good work. Oh, sorry. Oh, this one's quite slow, actually. He wasn't running anywhere. He was just walking slowly. Because you know what walks really slowly? Okay. I know. Turtles. And that's what this is. Oh, well, turtles See? do walk real slow. Turtles. For sure. Uh, and let's, let's try another one. Okay. Uh, this is going to be a Here, there, that you said wasn't rabbit. I'm sure it wasn't rabbit. This has got the 
So. Um. Let's try another one. Let's try another one. Ranger, um. <laughs> These are really tricky, so don't feel bad. All right, I get this one for sure. Okay. Ants, fire ants, fire ants. Don't let them bite you. Those will hurt real bad. Okay, I'm gonna be real brave. Please be very careful with those. Okay. Don't well, I, um, I would love to say that you got them all right, Ranger, but you got most. What, what counts is that you gave it a good try. I tried very hard. And maybe you start thinking about other day jobs. Maybe. I like it. I'm better when I can see. Okay, Okay, well, let's see what's next. I hope you had so much fun today. I am having a blast. I I'm getting fishing lessons from Hope. Okay, I'll, I'll show you how I cast. Ow! Kate! You hooked me! Um, we'll, we'll see you soon. Ow. I better go.